so 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 back though today got a really 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 i'm um, quick duck about a video i want to do though really quick i haven't done that in a minute i like really 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 of course but really though i am gonna not spend too long on this i know a lot of people can be mad about the memorial stone because i know that's been going on a big thing right now but of course though, we got lots and lots and lots of new stuff for um both global, global and jp the 350 million downloads is officially started for both versions and i know it's not called 350 now it's a worldwide campaign but it's realistically 350 million because last year it was the 100 million, and we already try pretty much do that for a lot of that. I guess I did every year, no. It was at 4 million! Well, that's at least next year, technically. So, you know, 450, then 3, then 500. You know, it doesn't go that far in the year, which I feel like it does because it is one of the top gacha games in the markets out there. So, for both of them, we're going to be realistic. Anyway, because a lot of people do mainly main global, and a lot of people mainly main JP. Of course, going right into the video, though, of course, we have. Of course, we have the Doka Pet teaser for um, Vegeta, and of course, the one right here. Um, again though, um, again, we have the JP teasers with them already. I did like it though, because I know the new movie kind of showed off those assets and stuff like that. I was like, okay, that's kind of cool. I like that. But yeah, um, of course though, like I said though, again, I'm going to try to make this video as quick as I can, because I know there's a lot of stuff I want to go over though really quick. Um, of course, we got a lot of really good new stuff up here. Um, of course, we have the Doki Fest teasers, of course, for Buhan and Vegito again. And we have the JP versions of them as well, like I said, it's for both Bobo and JP. And this time around, again, typical, typical, typical stuff, of course. Yeah, like I said, of course, we finally have the campaign here. Um, right down a little bit. Yeah, of course, finally, finally, let me fix my cover. Uh, um, but yeah, of course, finally, finally, finally. I know everyone in the moment is waiting for this. We've got some new assets right there. It looks freaking nice, awesome, beautiful. All the colors blending right together, so let's get it started. So yeah, um, I think when I saw the campaign and stuff like that, I saw this new Vegito and Goku on the guitar asset, and I was like, I was like, holy crap, um, I look at SSR art for Vegeta, because, you know, we could have, like, a Goku and Angel Vegeta, a regular base from Goku and, you know, Angel Vegeta that goes into, um, you know, Vegeta and stuff like that, you know, and, and then the Super Vegeta, because it's kind of obvious because of the trailer, because all the assets, like, early quality and stuff like that, you know, for Super Attack. With Joking Now, I know the time's recording tonight, we're going to get the Joking Now stuff. Again, I'll probably upload this a day later, or maybe whenever I can. I'll probably upload like, this one when we're going to get for Joking Now. I'm going to upload those, of course. But yeah, like I said, though, um, um, I'm trying to think. I'm mean, joking, that should be tonight and stuff like that. Of course, for JP, we have a live stream. Again, it might be like a video format where, you know, it's going to be a video and not actually live because, you know, the whole, you know, worldwide virus going on and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, of course, getting right to the campaign info, of course. We've got lots of good new stuff up in here. So let's get started. Um, okay, kind of checked out for there for a second. Let me right now. Um, okay, just kind of scrolling down a little bit. Of course, we have the um, new movie and stuff like that. We'll go in game and stuff like that. It's already there. Um, let's work out a little bit more. Of course, we have um, social log emojis again for both Google and JP. This is the exact same version and stuff like that again because it's only looking with and stuff like that now. Of course, we got um, new missions and stuff like that. Basically, you know, each zone every single day. Um, the logo bonus that has like 76 stones, which is really good. Though. That's really awesome. I kind of like the Doku Wiki because it has like everything is so organized and like straight, and I love it. Um, so of course, down here, I know we have part one missions and stuff like that. Of course, again, for both Google and JP, it's simple stuff, yeah. Like easy, okay, so yeah, basically, it's the awakening one unit. Um, yeah, 25 um, nodes on the hidden potential system, any type of unit. Um, yeah, clear any stage once within one turn. I mean, you can probably you can do that with the Peppy Gals. Um, but it's a total event. You can do that again. You can end, like, end a lot of fights in like one turn anyway. So, because you have like an AoE or something like that, where you know, just go and you know, do the link grinding where you can go to the stage, fight Simon Man, and just do all that. It's simple stuff like that, of course. But, yeah. Of course, it's a battle story event. Typical mission stuff, of course. Um, do you have to continue just going through stages? You know, win the stage or I can get some Zenny. Again, simple stuff like that. Of course, we got a new escape from um, the habitants of Boo. Basically, you know, it's a worldwide co op. I think it's a leak already, you know, Global vs. JP thing. Um, I don't think we still have those units yet, like confirmed. So I guess in the last stream, we're going to counter throw that. I know this is all the assets from the Buhan, OG Buhan um, event. Or basically, in the event, they're like, kind of down the Boo so you can um, basically be in the free season and stuff like that. Like, it, like Boo goes to all the forms like Buhan, Boo tanks, all of them. But of course, though, um, yeah, these are all special missions, again, for both Global and JP. Yeah, dang. They didn't really give you that much time to do this. So, yeah, again, it was only like a couple of days and stuff like that. They did last year go on the sale and stuff like that. They did it for the 5 year anniversary. Again, for 5 year anniversary, I want to say the event will go drop tonight, but we have no confirmation at all. Because it's the first time ever, one of the first times ever in Doki, they do not show the actual camp banner, like, you know, um, time and stuff like that, you know, when it drops and stuff like that. So, I guess maybe tonight, because for the 5 year anniversary, they did that for um, JP. With um, literally the live stream and the live stream, we're about to end this stuff like that. And the guy who said the um, OJ Six Time. Um, with the um, Vegito, LR Gogeta, the Blue Fusion Zombie, um, saying the missions in the background. But you guys don't know about that. That was for the live stream for the um, five year anniversary for JP. Um, 
the banners literally went live. Everybody loved, was looking at live streams. The banners like, went live and stuff like that. I think JP already hit like number one even before the banners dropped. I think they're already number one. Way before the banners dropped again, though. But yeah, again, this um, Gold Bunny JP thing, of course, you know, we both had to do this at the same time stuff. Uh, we're basically, you know, just doing missions and stuff like that, you know, waking the unit, get free and go hunt and stuff like that. Um, yeah, rank one, yeah, consume, um, dang, 400 million stamina, dang. Yeah, it's simple, yeah, just consuming stamina. It makes sense because, you know, you gotta, they gotta wiggle us a while. <laughs> yeah, um, but yeah. A lot of that has used some of the assets in the boost or um, super attack. They've been doing that for the last couple of days. Yeah, it's simple stuff like that. Yeah, personal missions, um, people can do. Again, you know, there's no worse to do this, but if you want to, you know, kind of someone help out and stuff like that. But, and of course, if we do, if we all get all, if we get all these missions done, we get new wallpaper. Again, I'll have this as my background, stuff like that from my phone now. So, because again, this wallpaper looks really nice. Of course, it's a title screen and stuff like that. Um, now that the game will be um, reset, part really reset. Of course, we can see it from both Copa and the movie. Um, I will upload a special movie on my channel, hopefully. I don't, I'm kind of scared because I, I do not want to get copyright claimed or anything like that. Um, specifically, but yeah. Um, hopefully, though, I don't want it. That's why I kind of, I'm scared to kind of do it now. Um, can I go down? Can I go down? Okay, there we go. I don't know why it was kind of messed up right now. Of course, we do Doku Fest, of course, for, um, you know, uh, um, Goku, of course, based from Goku and, of course, an Angel Vegeta, specifically. The Doku Wake comes with Vegeta, of course. Um, actually, if I have, you know, actual skills of base form, you know, um, using the Vegeta, base form, the should go to Super Saiyan, that's how it was in the manga. Literally, like, the Vegeta, I think base form Vegeta literally had one um, panel. They went super, that was it. So, of course, now we got a new blue tank that goes into the Han. It was obvious in the movie, but we're gonna get the story asset. It's probably, again, you know, giving the story event, we're gonna get probably like 5,000 new assets. Having with Piccolo, I think having with just from the Goku and Frieza, gonna happen here every time. So, yeah. For the blue vent, of course, we do not need the, um, you know, blue and gold tanks, the transforming versions of them to add, add, add the stage. They're gonna add it anyway, who cares? Again, just gonna come to Gobo. It's gonna be kind of weird because Gobo probably gonna do Ultimate Gohan next in October, then November's gonna hit right to Blue Saga stuff. So, Gobo's got, it's kind of moving back in time a little bit. But then, I think at the um, end of, I think December or the end of the year, there was the Doku the Fest that comes in May slash April for Gobo. When JP's having the Gordon Wing stuff, I think around May ish. Um, I think that's when Gobo specifically um, gets like that type of thing. Near yeah, the end of the year, Doku Fest. I, I'll be thinking I can actually finish off the Blue Saga. I like, you know, a Boo and like, you know, Goku and stuff like that. You know, so we're saying like, Goku, which everybody expects. Like, part 2, I love Kid Boo, and blah 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 blah. Of course, we have yeah. um, updates for the story events, um, updates for the, um, you know, events and stuff like that. Um, the Doku Fest. Um, of course, you know, the, um, Golden JP campaigns, um, banners up and stuff like that, of course. I think he's the Memorial Stone, which I will go over in a second, how they about to get that and stuff like that. Of course, we have the new God Stone, um, character stuff like that for both Global, for both Global and JP. You can go up to, you can get up to, this is like, the fourth. Again, I need to get the units when I want to, because I don't really care. Because you can use it at any time, it doesn't really matter. Um, I like this skate, because these units aren't here really good, I'll go over in a second, because, um, I guess for both Global and JP, they did update the list and stuff like that. Looks honestly really nice, though, honestly. Of course, type of list. Of course, you know, Purple Stone is always back all the time. They update some units on there. Um, Super Cells and stuff like that. Nice that. I'm not sure for that. Of course, the new story event that is live in the game. Ultimate Show, um, Showdown, the final battle. Of course, it's going to get updated and stuff like that. Um, we have a new, um, you know, full stamina, a new um, large meat item, which we can get in the game. We'll go to that in a second. Plus, Rich 11 is live. We'll do Memorial Stone. I think I hear it's really it kind of. I know SNS campaign for, I think, JP. But you can do, like, line and stuff like that. Get 12 stones. I think I was having, like, a similar version of that. I don't know. And potato system's all open, um, or the Kai banner, it's always up no matter what. And you can kind of tell, like, you know, what part two is going to come out and stuff like that because, of course, the time is the end date. I mean, with LR Jiren, you know, where the, um, the end date was like, I think, like 5, 7, 16. Then that we had the, um, or the Kai banner or stuff like that. And then after that we had like, part two, LR Jiren and stuff like that. The launch event from last year, I was back, you can use that to 20 stones every single day. I uh, like 7 stones to add up to like 20 stones. Okay, no, you got up to 100 stones. Um, so a lot of people are getting confused, you know, a gold over JP, we're gonna get 100 free stones. I think they're talking about, I think they're also talking about this event, just this event, we can get 100 stones. Um, again, they brought us back last year and stuff like that, we're gonna be able to bring it back this year. And of course, they have a new special, um, Battlefield Modern Boo, um, which should be a couple, probably tomorrow night. It probably will drop the, um, Battlefield units, maybe. We'll get, like, a couple, like, you know, like a Dende and, like, a Hercule, you know, Goku and, like, Deku or whatever, you know. So, um, Fail Fusion and stuff like that, because Goku's imagining, I think, Dende Fusion with a Katara. And I think also was Hercule, a Goku and Hercule, Goku, Goku. I'm just on, that's how I pronounce it. But yeah, of course, gonna go over all this stuff really quick. Again, lots of little stuff for a part, which is part one. It was actually really good. Yeah, again, though, when this comes out for, um, you know, when everything's done with the campaign for like the very last day, I will go for everything. Overall, I did it for the five year anniversary. Um, I do it for all the anniversaries. I don't really do it for thank you celebration because that's, um, I think that kind of just pops up here and there, I guess. But yeah, of course. 
I'm gonna go for all the new rest of you to stuff like that which ones you should get because again I'll try to wrap it up all into one big video. I don't like to kind of make separate videos even though tonight I'm gonna make another one for the Jeff Lash room. Then go over everything that we got kind of there. I know a lot of people are mad about the memorial stone. I kind of get their pain though because I think every unit on there is like because when the it's literally everybody on the Delta Fest banner, the current one, the, um for the tickets and stuff like that. I think literally it's just all them. It's literally actually I do have my tablet here, so yeah, I kinda kinda <laughs> I was watching something on, my, on YouTube, so, yeah. Again, I'll try to upload this video as soon as I can, though, uh, whenever it gets done, because I'd like to make my videos smooth and sexy for you guys, of course. 60 frames per second, that's all I like it, of course. But yeah, um, again, it's for, it's for both Global and JP, of course. Again, we have lots of new stuff live, so go to stuff like that. Again, I'll probably upload the movie on my Instagram, that's why I kind of like doing it there. Again, all the stuff will link below, though, of course. But I know this part was kind of definitely longer. But anyway, I'm jumping right to the next stuff, of course. But yeah. Well, it's just like for part one, though. I know it's the context of gold, but we don't have those, um, Goten and Trunks Awakenings. Those are our, um, assets for, um, Goten and Trunks Attack. I think Goten, and no, it was Tech, um, Int, Goten, and I think Super Saiyan Trunks. I know, I like those to get Awakenings early for gold, but it's not they didn't bring that. I think that's that's tied to, like, the Trunks, um, campaign, um, Goten's campaign, because they do Dogen Awakening from that event and stuff like that. But yeah, um, like I said, though, I'm gonna, um, head to the rest of the video, so, of course, um, this launch event, again, like, every day you get, um, 10 stones that adds up to um, 70 stones. I think, um, yeah, it kills every day. You get 10 stones in your curse. You can only do it once a day, now. so make sure to do this every single day. Again, this just start, they came up last year on Cell Saga and stuff like that. This one is a lot sooner. 2018, 2019. Yeah, because, uh, yeah, I remember um, this came out, I think, with Jeffrey Goku and Frieza. I did um, go over, like, why you guys should farm and stuff like that, and you know, every single day. Um, I don't really, really, make, really need to make separate videos for those anymore. Back in the day, I did. Just because I was really, like, view hungry ish. Yeah, really view hungry. I just did it because I really wanted to. I was joking about the view hunger thing I was, so yeah. Of course, um, it's gonna add up all to 100 stones. It does every year, kind of, at this point. It did with PyCon. I think starting with, really, Super Saiyan PyCon, and I want to say Goku. Um, Super KO King Goku and PyCon. Um, that's where it kind of started the trend. Where basically, you can farm that out every single day and get, like, 100 stones and stuff like that. Um, adds up to 100 stones. Um, again, from, make sure to farm that out every single day. Again, from that out in, every single day. Make sure to do it. Of course, the new Boo Story event. Again, we got some new assets right there for Chris Perkyo and um, Vegeta, so... Um, you know, active skill Perkyo right there. <laughs> um, you know, spare on Goku. <laughs> Everybody want it? You know, we got a new Vegeta asset right there. Of course, you know, assets. <laughs> uh, I am just saying, though, this could be card arts because there's a lot of assets from this. Um, but of course, though, um... Like I said, though, of course, you know, this is uh, basically the story event and stuff like that, of course, right here. But again, we already know update in the future, of course, you know, it only goes up, I guess, to the Super Vegeta stuff. Then maybe when it comes out, we'll get more story event updates, you know, part two, you know, the 19th of September. We'll probably see some more stuff there. Uh, we'll probably see part two stuff there. Of course, the new Goku and Hercule. We're in my video, though, of course. Hercule really good, and Goku, of course, but yeah. Like I said, though, um, I think this is the ticket banner I was talking about. But yeah, um, pretty much how I'm doing the video already. But yeah, like I said, though, um... Um, that Goku and Herco, though, of course, you know, so if I get Goku Waken, I know a lot of people are gonna be kinda mad, cause, you know, oh yeah, cause I know they're supposed to be, like, the winning and losing version of, like, you know, over the JP cards, um, that we're gonna possibly get, we don't still know the students just yet, but, still, it kinda happens up here and there, but of course, though, like I said, um, like I completely said, though, um, sorry, though, my head's trying to hurt right now, so, oof, I don't know what the heck is going on with right now, oof, okay, but yeah, like I said, though, of course, um, you do a launch event every single day. That new store event is going to be up, so you can go ahead and do that. Um, I know it's a cool thing to take a banner. I think right here it's just Chain Battle. Because we actually do have the Chain Battle rewards. These are all the rewards right now for up for Chain Battle. Um, of course, I went over this uh, pretty much already on my Chain Battle video. But uh, like I said, though, of course, these are all the basic rewards and stuff like that. Again, you don't have to, have to hit top number one. You don't have to hit number two, whatever. Because again, the rewards are actually live in the game. Um, again, you get, like, you know, you get emblem for equipment and stuff like that. And the Shop where you get full get equipment there. We get stickers, Kai's orbs, Platinum Turtle shells, which we kind of can get every single day now. Kind of weird, but it happens though. But yeah, of course, the Chain Battle rewards are live in the game. So yeah, these are all the top rankings. If you rank them with these, um, you basically get the rewards. I did hit number two slash three, and it kind of came up quick though. I don't know if for, I think it's not for JP. I don't know if they're on JP. I don't know if they're on football right now at times recording. So we'll probably, again, if it is, then you already know, post on Instagram, stuff like that, of course. But yeah. Um, I did get number two slash three. I, I had number one like the very first day, and I was like, uh, I went down to like um, four slash five. Then yesterday I got back. I literally almost hit like a hundred million. Like literally, almost hit a hundred million. I was like, Are you kidding me? Like this close? And I read in my video. I was like, I was coming for you guys, but yeah. Oh, I'm so pissed off. I know I don't hit no, top number one, but I, I know like I just so. Yeah. Never here. I think it's boss rush down here. Um, again, they updated pretty well, though. I mean, some of these Delta Fest are going to be really tough for some people because, again, Gohan and Piccolo are pretty, going to be pretty much easy. 
I'm going to also might be a little bit hard because he can't hit, actually hit hard. And Amigoku can be difficult as well. He can hit hard as well. Into Genta and Trunks also can hit hard. Um, they can hit. They have a three, two, one countdown where basically you don't finish them off and set them out of turns. You will die. So yeah, the first three are really tough though. Basically, name it Goku and I want to say um um I'm going to Goten. You got to be careful. I'm really saying though, be um careful. I'm not joking. Really be careful because those events can be really difficult. And of course, you know about Zamasu and stuff like that. Zamasu can be pretty hard, hit hard as well, and not as much. But yeah, I'm gonna go with that there. Um, left three bus rush live. I need some of the um, new redstone units and stuff like that, which I will go over in a second. Again, the ones I recommend, I can't really recommend like all of them though, but yeah. The ones I recommend are Sierra Gogeta. Uh, Tech Tail is amazing, he's still amazing. Full Power Freeze is still good. Tech Bears is amazing. Um, Engine Up is amazing. Super Tank 3 is still amazing. Kid Boo, I'll say he has a little bit because no one really runs them like that. You know, for some side units, really, but he's still good. Um, Ultima Gohan, eh. Uh, Super Tank 3 Vegeta can be really amazing as well. Um, SCR Beerus is amazing. Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta is right there, is amazing. Um, Nim um, Mimito Cooler Movie Goku is good. Um, Ink Cooler probably has a number one because he's amazing. Um, the, um, Vegeta and Trucks are amazing as well. I think the only one really I'm missing on here is, um, Age of Cooler. I might have to get her myself because I'm not have her at all. Because again, they are going to get easy A's on, um, Goku and stuff like that. They kind of mention it right here, I want to say. Um, I guess I want to say really get, kind of try to get killed Cooler or whatever. I know they mention it right here, I think. Yeah, like they, they can um they can be easy to hate, but a lot of people are so sad about that because for global in context of global, we did not get them at all yet. Really weird because global didn't get them at all. I don't know why. Because again, we were supposed to get it, but we didn't. But, yeah, and of course the um purple stone stuff like that. Again, they actually got some of the units. Actually, they're really good. Like I, the rolling one is good. My favorite one right here, Goku Black one. They made that one good last year because again, you can't get the truck second for free. So I probably wouldn't say go for this one because you can't get the truck for free. You say they did it as well. Yeah, Goku is amazing. Goku Black um Goku Black is so amazing. To, you know, to this day, um, Majin Buu's ones are amazing as well. Again, the ones I recommend are Majin Buu. Um, this one, probably number one, number two, probably because that Hercule is amazing though. He really is good for the battle royale. Amazing Goku. Majin Buu has eight a little bit, but he still is good. I mean, I mean, all some of are you know don't really have defense like that, but they are still good. Trunks one is really good because these two guys are amazing. Yeah, Trunks has eight. His damage has eight, but he's still good. Um, Gohan one probably not because uh, sixteen sucks. Gohan's still amazing. S A is still good at revamp. Um, Sunjuin, Sunjuin's pretty solid and stuff like that. Bardock 1, Goku's good, Bardock's good. Um, again, L Bardock has been replaced, so you know, by Joker Fest. Kind of part, he really, he's really underrated, but he really is good. I would say the Beerus one probably is good as well, because L Beerus is still good. He's several key. But the Blue Goku and Blue Vegeta right here is amazing, though. Um, Tepion one's amazing too, because Tepion, of course, both Tepions are good. Super Tepion 3 Goku is still good. Um, Bojack one's pretty amazing as well, because you can get, um, this guy. Um, Golden Freeze is good. Bojack has AIDS a little bit, but he still wants um, good units that AIDS well. Um, I know, um, Lord Slug is still pretty good. I still see a lot of people running here and there. But those and Trunks one are really amazing as well, because they, these guys are amazing after they, after they awaken. So yeah, again, those are the ones that I kind of recommend getting. And right here's the new item event we're basically every single day. Of course, make sure to do this every single day. You get the large and you get to meet right here. Again, it's only one stage, so, you know, probably like, you know, extra, never really extra drops or whatever, but typical stuff. I know there's the memorial stone right here. But basically, um, probably 50 stones using the game from last year, basically over, uh, over a year from last year to now, basically. Um, you get one stone. See, I know a lot of people are going to be checking because, um, literally, you only use all, all use for new LR, um, for new, um, ticket banner for, um, Goldman JP. I know a lot of people are gonna be mad because of um, requirements, because it takes 150 um, memorial stones to get these guys. I know a lot of people are gonna be mad because you cannot get them at all. Because um, again, it's only 150 stones. Like, they need to cut this in half. Maybe they'll make it like at least five or something like that, or 10 or 15 or 20. Because I don't know, 50, I feel like 150 is kind of a bit too much because a lot of people, I mean, it's kind of cheap. I know it's kind of designed, you know, for whales, everybody thinks that, but again, this is not for everybody. I know for me, man, I work hard on the bike anniversary, so yeah. Um, again, though, realistically, though, it is kind of messed up, so I'm going to talk about it really quick in this video. I kind of get why everybody's mad, though. Trust me, I get why you're mad, because literally, though, it's literally just 150, like, again, again though, memorial stones are based on how many stones you get in the game. You gotta do this or save for the ticket banner, which I think everybody else is doing, just getting tickets. But again, you have like 150, go and get one of these guys. I feel like these guys it should get like two or three. Like, cut this in, like, cut the, cut the stones in half. That kind of really, that kind of really isn't fair for like three players and stuff like that. You know, everybody, the moms, not gonna have like 150 stones. People are just starting out in the game and stuff like that. You know, people put last year to now and stuff like that. Um, art, you know, because a lot of people are just want, because you know, everybody in the moms still saving for a high rise value banners. Now everybody's coming on the same, like every banner, every celebration, like Truth, Noir, and Gresh, but. 
I don't know, I'm just saying, yeah, cut, at least cut the stone in half for everybody. I, that kind of really isn't fair, though, honestly, for Bandai. Um, honestly, though, I mean, not, that's not a way to kill your game, but that's kind of way, that's a big way to take your audience away. For people who, like, who love Doki and stuff like that, like Rhyme, of course, you know, Truth, Nano, Gresh, Noir, Social Fire, Jinro, um, just on the top of my head, um, like, all those people love, love Doki. Like, they, that's their job almost every single day. But, at the same time, like, you kind of take away this value for people, because it's like, What's the point? It's just like, literally, it is like, yeah, literally, for one of these units, it is 150. And a lot of people are mad as well, because again, no one's gonna have 150. It, it, you could have like 149, but like, oh my gosh, I'm so close. I feel like we should at least cut it in half for everybody. I know a lot of people are gonna complain about it. Maybe the next day, gonna, people are gonna be mad about it and stuff like that, of course, and everybody in the bombs gonna be right to knowing about it, though. But it kind of really isn't fair, though. I feel like we should cut it in half to lose 20 or 15, even 5, because again, 150, I feel like it's not a lot, but. In the context, a lot of people aren't going to have that many. Because a lot of people are going to get, like, the Moro ticket. I'd rather say use the use only ticket than get one of these Dragon Fest units. But at the same time, you're getting one of those kind of for free, but you're not because you are using stones to get the Memorial Dragon Stone. But then at the same time, it's also like... Like, really, though, Bandai is like... Could you at least, like, you know, not think about other people, but, I mean, yeah, think about other people, though, because, you know, a lot of people are not going to well out as much as all these, all these, all these um, other people are in the world, but, I don't know, I mean, I'm not mad about it, personally, though, but if I am off, like, by one, and I can't get the unit I really want, I am going to be pissed, because it's, like, 150, I feel like it's kind of a little bit too much, at least make it 50 or 25 or something, I don't know. Yeah, that's all we really want to go today. Again, they're going to end the video here. Yeah, like I said, let's cut it in half or something like that. Come on, be fair to other people. Like, just, I mean, just, just like, and be like, oh, yeah, I'm always on the ticket and pull hot fire garbage and not get the unit I really want. Like, come on, I encourage you to get the unit you want for free, basically, almost. Um, you know, you're not using stones to get them, but you are technically because you know you're using stones to get them, but stone, the memorial stone. But at the same time, it's like, I really feel like they should just honestly just like, just like really cut it in half or something like that. You know, for people who really want like Piccolo, the Piccolo is a favorite character, like my mom. My mom really loves Piccolo in Dragon Ball. Um, you know, she probably can't get it because, you know, she doesn't have that many. Because, you know, a lot of people aren't going to summon on every single banner. Like me, I summon on every banner I feel like I have a missing units on. How, how I get really good value, like the five anniversary banners. Like, I have all my stuff in there. Still got trash. I still book both the fire anniversary units, though. But of course, yeah. But yeah, at least cut this on half or whatever. But yeah. Um, it's really it, though. But of course, though, um, yeah, that's a worldwide campaign though, of course, have fun, but when it's stuff out, I know a lot of people are going to be mad about, about the Memorial Stone, I know because basically all the units are going to the banner, I know a lot of people are going to be mad, stuff like that, but yeah, Vegito and Wuhan being the university units, um, maybe for um, the downside for years, so yeah, what you guys think though, of course, but yeah, see you guys later though, thanks for watching, have a great day, for all cool joints, you can know, part 2 could be on the 15th of September, again, this celebration goes from now until like the, um, from the, end, from the end of August, to September, of course, a couple more hours, we should be getting last year, info. Gonna make a video on that, go over everything. Gonna go ahead and be here, though. But yeah, see you guys later, though. Again, though, peace out.